Hi, I'm Ati Weisner. I'm the Director of Financial Services and Support at Lamana Chai, and I'm here with some tips on the coronavirus pandemic. There are defining moments and events throughout history that have changed the world forever. The coronavirus is one of those events. I do not believe we are going back to where we were. Through all the chaos, a new post-corona world will emerge. It's too early to know what that new normal will look like. But what we do know is that this pandemic has affected the entire world population, financially, emotionally, and physically. Let's talk business. So many are out of work, but those who are still working are quickly adapting to the new realities, video conferencing, chats, and the whole online experience. We are learning how to work alone. Large corporations to the smallest businesses will be assessing this new phenomenon, learning how to stay competitive and reinvent themselves in this new world. So here are some tips for employees. One, stay relevant. Even if you have been temporarily laid off from work, stay connected. Perhaps volunteer some free services. Let the organization know you are ready and willing to help out during this difficult time. Two, loyalty. As businesses and corporations rely more and more on employees working remotely, the concept of loyalty will be emphasized more than ever before. So right up there with productivity, companies will want to know who they can trust. So do what you can to show them you can be trusted. Three, out of the box thinking. Get out of your comfort zone, this is key. Take the time to really understand the mission and objectives of the company that employs you. Are the original objectives still relevant? Have they changed in the post-corona world? What new suggestions can you offer? And can you help coordinate new meaningful solutions? Remember, employers will need employees who are quick on their feet and who are able to see the big picture. They will be looking for innovators. Be that innovator. Stay tuned for part two, the small business opportunity. Until next time, stay safe and financially healthy.